Your identity dictates your walk in life. Hey, this might be one of my most powerful 90 second teachings. Watch till the end, we're talking about wisdom. Proverbs 28, 18 says, whoever walks blamelessly will be saved. Now, how many of you know we can't earn salvation? We can't earn uh, forgiveness of sins. We can't earn our way to heaven or God. But Colossians 1, 21 through 23 tells us that God has made us right with himself through the death and the blood of Jesus Christ. And those of us who believe in him and trust in him have been made holy, blameless, and righteous. Now, that is your identity if you're born again, holy, blameless, and righteous. That's who you are. But if it's just information, if you don't have a revelation, then it won't transfer to your walk. There are people that are holy, blameless, and righteous in the sight of God that don't believe they are, or can't see how they are. Or maybe they're blinded by the issues of life or, or they're stuck in sin, they're backsliding. And so they have a wrong identity and they will begin to walk out that wrong identity. Today, I want to encourage and remind you, you are blameless, holy, and righteous in the sight of God if you are born again. Begin to walk that out. It's what you are versus what you do. It's the life that Jesus paid for versus the life that you are choosing to walk out. Don't let this just be a positional thing. Understand that it is who you are in Christ.